Hi guys, Twinkle Phoenix here, and um, welcome back to, of course, another Zen, the night shift, Iggy's Man House. Yeah, you remember this image, right? Of, like, all the posters all over the floor? Well, remember how we said in the last episode, um, in one of the, yeah, the previous episode, I said I was gonna, like, brighten up everything. Not, not the previous episode, the episode before that, I said I was gonna brighten up everything, and I did, but I was reading through the comments, and do you remember how I said something, like, um, perhaps the following? Try the Tamble flashing soup. Now, I don't know if Tamble would also refer to probably another member of the cast. Maybe they made, uh, named a soup after maybe another member. I don't know. <laughs> Try the Tambles. Again, Tambles. I don't know why, but I mean, as soon as I hear the word Tamble smashing soup, I don't know why. It makes me think of that demented blooming monkey over there. There was a reason for that. Um, the creator provided this comment then, just to make a vain suspicion that the thing you're seeing um, is just a wire across the ceiling. Don't worry, the clown and tambles will probably be in the full version, not the demo. Really depends. Try the video again. I'm glad you enjoyed it. But um, I know who tambles is just now. I will, I will... It's just every time I hear the word tambles, it made me think of the goddamn thing. This is the image that I'm referring to. This, I believe, is none than Tambles. I, you know, stretched it more, and as you can see, there's a bunch of children, and they seem to be screaming. I brightened it up. Now, what you can clearly see is three people. One is, like, screaming, ah! The other one's like, ah, covered his ears because it's freaking loud. And that other person, I don't know if they're crying, or they're, like, trying to, trying to cover their ears or something. I'm assuming it's a parent. Either way, there's a kid running away. There's one covering their ears. And I... Tambles is just demented and it's huge. This, of course, is what I was referring to. This is the monkey thing I, I'm talking about. This weird thing with like the whatever the goddamn thing is. It's battery operated and it constantly bashes those symbols over and over and over again. That will get on my nerves. But yeah, apparently he's he's you know, famous enough to have soup named after him. So at least we now know Iggy. And Tambles. So this time we assume it must be Tambles. So the goddamn monkey has a name, his name is Tambles, and I'd like you all to meet him. The very demented, I'm assuming he's gonna be extremely loud. He has soup named after him. Next up, of course, was this dog. Now, I've written this up, and again, it doesn't look much like Iggy. I don't know if it's supposed to be Iggy, but it doesn't look like a very happy dog to me personally. And of course, then the last one is the clown. And if you notice, the key is happy to have the balloon, not the clown. Something tells me from this image alone, if you see that with all the others, Tambles has got kids with him. Obviously, they don't like his sound. The dog has nobody. Nobody's gone to the dog. Which is kind of weird, but the dog looks really angry. Like, you know, none of the kids want to go near it. And yet there's a clown. Maybe the dog and the clown are in the same area. Maybe it's part of the same picture. Maybe it's actually showing us something. So I mean, clearly the dog's not happy. And he's he's got grass on the bottom of his one. And so is the clown. Maybe they're actually part of the same image. Maybe. But then again, like, the scribble on the bottom could just be writing. Because I honestly don't know. I can't even goddamn read that. I'm assuming it might be backwards, upside down. Or oh, I honestly don't know. Either way, the kid is definitely happy to have the balloon. Whereas the children in this picture just seem to be suffering, saying shut up. But yes, that is all of the images. And of course, Tamble is supposed to be that loud thing. I read about those. Apparently, they constantly do bash that blinging symbol thing. I think I prefer Iggy the dog. If Iggy is the dog. And again, guys, I'm really glad that you all are enjoying the Discovery series. And yes, I am I was shocked. I was reading through the comments this afternoon. And um, just telling I'm recording this now. And it was only like a few minutes ago. And I was reading through the comments. And I realised then the name Tambles came up. And I was like, hang on. That's the... The name of the soup. Tumbles, it's the monkey. 
and the monkey looks huge so I'm assuming he might possibly be the same size as the dog Iggy. I don't know if the dog is Iggy or if that is the dog in the image supposed to be Iggy. It's a very bad drawing of Iggy if it is. But that monkey looks absolutely scary and terrifying. I don't want him near me. No way in hell do I want that near me. I, forget. I don't mind the clown. Don't mind the clown at all. The clown looks happy and lovely. I, I'll go near him any time on the dog. But the, the monkey thing? No way in heck am I going near him. But I'm going to have to when I play the game. Anyway guys, uh, more uh, Iggy, fan, Iggy's fan house discoveries will be up on the channel and much more. So stay tuned. And you guys, because it's the weekend, my parents are home. Meaning they normally interrupt my recordings again. But no worries, tomorrow they're going to be out so I can upload all I want to know is going to make a sound. Except for my cat, who also doesn't care. Anyway, you guys, I do hope you enjoyed that episode and yeah, more will be coming up. Ooh. I'm sorry, it's just that monkey is just creepy. I, I'm going to look at the happy clown. That's better. Well, um, no, I can still see the goddamn monkey at the bottom now. Can't win. So, yeah, guys, thanks again. And yay, I'm glad that the creator actually watches my videos and enjoys what I do. So, yeah, guys, um, more bits coming up. This is a happy clown. Bye-bye.